here's a problem that has a radical um, in it, so we need to isolate this radical. We'll leave it on the left side, add 3x to both sides. And what we can now do is get rid of our radical by squaring both sides. We're left with the expression x plus 1. We do have to expand this binomial square, square the first term, square the 3, square the x. Double the product of the terms, 3x times 1 is 3x, doubled is 6x, square the last term, plus 1. So now as we solve this, we subtract 1 from both sides, which cancels completely. Subtract x from both sides, we get 0 is equal to 9x squared plus 5x. And what we can now do is uh, solve by factoring. Remove a common factor of x, leaving 9x plus 5. And when we solve this, set each of these factors equal to 0. The monomial factor gives you a value at 0. The binomial, we take the opposite of our constant, negative 5, divide by our leading coefficient, 9. So when we look at these, we need to test our answers. Let's plug in 0 up here. Square root of 0 plus 1 minus 3 times 0, does that equal 1? Here, square root of 1 minus 0 does equal 1, so 0 works. Plug in the negative 5 ninths. Negative 5 ninths plus 1, which is 9 ninths, minus 3 times negative 5 ninths. Does that equal 1? A negative times a negative is a positive. So here we get square root of 4 ninths, which is 2 thirds. Plus here the 3 and the 3 cancel. 5 thirds, does that equal 1? And when you look at this, the answer is no. So that is an extraneous solution.